Chicken egg cell contains about 95% by weight of calcium carbonate, a basic compound as we have learned along this unit. As we know, this basic compound will react with acid according to the following equilibrium reaction. As we have said in the equation, carbon dioxide is obtained, which is liberated as a gas. On other hand, all we have in our houses a vinegar bottle that we use for dressing our favorite veg vegetable salads. And everybody knows that vinegar has an acid acidic taste similarly to a wine wine bottle. That is because the wine fermentation has progressed further under air and convert wine into vinegar. The compound responsible for the acidity of vinegar is acetic acid, a weak organic acid with which, which easily react with base compound. So we are going to cover our excel with enough vinegar and let's examine what happened. As you can notice, some bubbles appear because of the carbon dioxide that is forming during the reaction. The process takes some time and we need to wait and it works better if we put freshly vinegar after a period of 24 hours. Now we will wait a week to complete the process. Ok, after 7 days, let's pour the vinegar down the drain and rinse it with top water. And we can see that the egg cell has been dissolved in the acid media, but the membrane inside the cell remains intact. So we have a naked egg that looks uh, translucent now because the hard side cell is gone, and you can notice as well that some of the vinegar has permitted through the X membrane and now the X is bigger. Let's try the strength of our naked eggs by bouncing in some hard surface. I will try first with a small distance. And as you can see, the eggs bounce. But be careful not to bounce the eggs very far away because the membrane could break. We have seen how the XL, which is made of calcium carbonate, a basic compound, readily reacts with vinegar, a common acid in our daily life.